The equation of state of a fluid defines the relationship between three thermodynamic properties, density, pressure, and temperature. The most familiar of these is the ideal gas equation of state, rho equals P divided by RT, where R is the gas constant. There are more sophisticated models, such as the van der Waals equation of state, which gives another expression for rho as a function of pressure and temperature, but it makes no sense to use both of those simultaneously. You either use the ideal gas equation of state, or you use the van der Waals equation of state, or indeed another equation of state. The simplest possible equation of state is to say that rho is uniform and constant. In other words, the density is neither a function of pressure nor of temperature. This is the incompressible fluid model, or if you like, the incompressible equation of state and you absolutely cannot use it at the same time as you use the ideal gas equation of state. And I underline that because that's a mistake that I see very often. Calculations become much easier with the incompressible fluid model. For example, here is the law of conservation of mass for a fluid whose density can vary in space and in time. If I expand the right-hand side using the product rule, I get minus rho divergence of the velocity minus v dot grad rho. But because of the incompressible fluid model, d rho by dt equals zero, and grad rho is equal to zero. And therefore, the above expression simplifies to the divergence of the velocity field is equal to zero. In other words, in an incompressible fluid, streamlines cannot be created or destroyed.